Thank you, Mr. Tan Gubine. It's our pleasure to have you today. I would like to ask a few questions. Uh, could you tell us why should young people get involved in the space industry and why should they study STEM subjects? Well, of course, space is a sector for the future. Uh, we are already very much dependent on space uh, assets today. Uh, everything that comes from space, weather forecasts, telecommunications, uh, navigations. But this is an industry that will only grow. Uh, we will only be more and more dependent on services coming from space. So it's very interesting, of course, for young people, if to, they want to be part of the future, that they want to help invest into the future and that they indeed study space-related uh, sciences. And of course, in general, our society is more and more evolving into a technology society and a society which is based on knowledge. And this is why investment into STEM, science, technology, engineering and math, is so important for young people to be able to be engaged in the future of this world. Thank you. And what inspired you when you were younger to join the space industry? When I was younger, it was a time of the big discoveries uh, in the universe. We discovered black holes, we discovered uh, supernovas, uh, white dwarfs. Uh, so I was dreaming and reading a lot about uh, all these uh, uh, far voyages uh, to the star. There was also the series Star Trek, uh, which was uh, very inspiring to me. So I always wanted to be flying in this spaceship and go into discovery of new worlds, uh, new societies, uh, new science, new technologies. Uh, and of course, uh, I was very lucky that uh, through my studies uh, in uh, humanities and then later on as engineering, that I finally got the opportunity and the possibility to indeed work in the space sector and eventually myself fly to space. So I'm a, a very, very happy man. Very inspiring. Thank you. And why should the new invest money and people in space? Space is a sector of the future. Uh, more and more countries around the world will become dependent on space assets. And therefore, of course, if as a country you want to have a certain independence, you want to have your own assets, it's important that you also invest into this new sector. A lot of people sometimes say space is a high cost, but actually space is not a cost, it's an investment into the future. It's an investment into jobs, it's an investment into science, it's an investment into knowledge. And this is why it's for every developed country, including the UIA, extremely important to invest into space. One last question, where do you see the space sector in 10 years? The space sector in 10 years will of course see a proliferation of actors. Uh, today, a lot more industrial companies, uh, private companies are getting active into space on their own assets with their own funding. Uh, also, more and more countries are having their own satellites. They will have their own space program, including the UAE. So I think it be, will become a much more diverse and therefore as well a much more interesting uh, world in space uh, in the next uh, 10 years. Thank you. Maybe we need to redo it because of the because I was a little bit distracted. We can redo the we can the redo last the last the last question. Thank you. Where do you think or where do you see the space sector in ten years? Well, today we already see that there are many more actors in the space sector than 10 years ago. We have private companies that are investing with their own money. Uh, we have more and more countries that are developing their own space assets, uh, including the UAE. So I think that uh, in the future, in 10 years from now, we will see a lot more space actors uh, there. It will be a much diverse uh, landscape than we have today but this also creates a lot of opportunities for everybody and especially a lot of opportunities for young people so I think uh, we will become more and more dependent on space with many more people with many more actors uh, being involved into the space sector thank you very much